Nice. Don't know if you can see. Well, you should be able to see that. <laughs> that lantern, All right? Can now be put on my side. And then, does it always stay there? No, it can put it away as well. Nice. So when we go for like a cave or something, we need to use both hands. We can now without having to hold the lantern in one hand. Nice little mod. Oh, you think you can run off on me? The hell? Oh no, that, that's no good. Okay, it stops. <laughs> no, stop, horse. <laughs> Billy? Can I call out for the horse? Hey, horse. Get me off this thing, it freaks. I'm pressing the X to calm horse, but I'm not actually saying anything. Weird. Come on, lift me down. I gotcha. Don't kick me, horse. You okay? You want a damn prize or something? Cut me loose! I would like a prize. Thanks, mister. Don't know how many times I tried to leave that crazy bastard, but he always came after me. I'm glad he's dead. Uh, sure. Serves me right taking the first man shines up on me. No problem. Yep, take his horse. Where was his body? Yeah, so I can also God damn hillbillies. apparently attach this lantern to the horse as well. I mean, it's a bit hard to really see right now because it's daytime, right? But when it's nighttime, I should be able to leave it attached. Boy. Uh, how do I do it? Did I just do it? Yeah, see, look, it's attached. You see it? It's cool, right? And I can, like, leave that on whilst also using the two-hander. It's nice. Nice. As always, if you're interested in the mod, link is in the description with all my other mods. Little quality of life mod, right? No, nothing major. But um, something that will help in the future for any cave exploring. Uh, what was I originally doing over here? There's uh, like some sort of flower. I've also been like collecting these flowers. I, I don't quite know if I should be, but they're on the map I'm using, and I kind of just want to clear them off rather than just sort of ignoring them. But I've not met any sort of person who says to collect them, right? I'm looking for some sort of orchid at the moment. Well, I have no idea what they look like. Oh, is that is this it? There it is. It's in the tree. This is like an exotic, rather than just something you craft with. See, look, you have discovered there's a cigar orchid. Find goods like these. Art of interest, you collect it. You can be found in the nicer parts of town. I've never met anyone. But I have that one and another orchid now. So, whatever. You have entered legendary animal territory. Hunt this legendary animal. Was it that? What did I run over? It wasn't a legendary toad, was it? What's the animal? A boar. Oh, and there's a clue here. Okay, we can do this. Here we are. Inspect the dung. Whoa, why are you ahead of me? <laughs> Where are you, boy? Boy, boy. Okay. What we got here? There's a snake over there. Get lost. Broken sticks. Which way did the sticks point, Arthur? Looks a way off. A way off. How much way off? Okay. Okay, just another clue. Sure. I heard like a, a growl? Oh, this can be quite dangerous, you know. Oh, it's a gator. It ain't gonna charge me, right? Can it see me? Must be near. No. Which way, Arthur? Which way, Arthur? Over this way? Okay. Was it this way? Did it turn? Where's this leading? Oh, is that it? Oh, hello! 
Oh, I feel so bad. Why can't I tech more? Tech more. Tag. Tech, tech more. Tech, tech more. Do all the tags. More tags. More tags. Please. Is that all? And he's dead. Sorry, mate. I feel quite bad. <laughs> He was just saying hello. What makes you legendary? Are you like big for a boar? Okay, got a pelt and uh, a horn. I guess the horn could be used for some sort of talisman, maybe. We'll go to the trapper and find out. Oh, please help. Oh, fuck. Hello? All right, friend. All right. You're going to be okay. You're going to help me? Uh, I can't. Hey, need a doctor. Oh, oh. oh. you gotta. Uh, I can't. You gotta. I can't. I've got no room. Don't have a spare horse. Maybe I can use yours. Please, do something. I'll get you uh, help. Just stay alive. Okay. Oh, I can store. Uh, okay. Why before then was that woman so pretentious that she couldn't sit on the back of my horse? Probably because it was a bear pelt. It was probably too big, right? That's probably what it was. Okay, I'll get you to the doctors. Say, Denny, sure. Uh, I'll ride as fast as I can. Stay with me. Fuck me. We're nearly there. Just hold on a little longer, all right? Yeah, as long as we don't get hit by lightning. <laughs> Must stay awake. Over halfway through autumn now. Quite looking forward to some snow. Be interesting. It's meant to be like uh, the online, right? At right, Christmas time. Where? Where am I? Say, Denny, getting you to the doctors. Did you give up now? I swear to God, if, when I hitch my horse, if anyone steals this pelt, I'm going to kill them. I'm dying. This is it. My arm. Feel it okay, buddy, we're here. You're gonna be okay. Oh, good God! Quickly, bring him in here. Mm-hmm. Right here. You sit him down in this chair. Mm-hmm. <sighs> what happened? Just saw you fall out of the saddle. Don't worry, you're at the doctor. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. Ah. Sure. There's also the matter of my payment. But we'll deal with that later. All right. All right. A lot of blood loss. And this wound's badly infected. Ah. I'll save as much as I can, but... Yeah. I'll have to amputate. What? What did you say? Just try to breathe. Uh, I'll give you something for the pain. No. There you are. Then I'll knock him out for a while. Can I watch? You did a good thing bringing him here. But now, I'd recommend moving along. Recommend? <clears throat> so I can <clears throat> stay then? You do not want to see this. Can I stay? Is he actually going to do it in front of me? Sorry it's come to this. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'll get oh, a better view. Jesus. <laughs> you got a spare spare clothes with you mate oh my god I wasn't even quick was it really What do you do with the arm now? Maybe he wants it. Memento? Can I take it? <laughs> well, you're in a bad way. But you'll pull through. Good job, Doc. That was good work, Doctor. Yeah, he's lucky. Wounds like that will kill you if you aren't careful. He's lucky he just lost the arm. <sighs> it's nice of you to stay, but don't
Don't fret. He'll make it. Okay, I'll be off. Hopefully nothing ever happens to me. Jesus. Come now. Just let him rest. Yeah. All we can do now is hope for the best. I'm going. I'm going. There's a trapper in in town. I did not know there was a trapper in St. Denis. That's so handy. I'll go there instead. Oh no, yeah, I know who this is. Yeah, there's like a stool. Right. Yeah. There's nothing I've ever used it. So what do you have for me? Okay, let's take a look at it. It's twenty dollars. Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. Yeah, what does the board do? So I looked it up rather than scrolling through everything. It's quite handy because the the other thing is next door, right? See what talismans I can get. So this makes some sort of shoes along with a bison pelt. Not over keen on those. What do I have equipped here? So I have the gun belt. Uh, I, I bought a bandolier. I don't have it equipped. Because it, it just works as a perk. You don't have to have it equipped, I don't think. Um, and the hol I do have the holster as well, right? Like a normal one? Yeah. But I can also buy an offhand one now. Uh, not much demand for coyote pelts, So can I use it? Except for one. Down in Scarlet Meadows. Big black beauty. Maybe I can use one. No one's ever caught him, though. I don't need to um, do the mission for my car. Just needed to be able to have one equipped, since the mission is one way of getting it. Otherwise, you can just buy one. All right, have a look at that. Right. The status it does is reduces the amount of maintenance required for weapons. So I may not be able to actually put anything in it yet. I have to see them when I get my horse. But the stats is nice. And it looks okay as well. Now the fence, because I could sell some stuff as well, get some a bit more money, get some funds, sell a gold bar or something. And maybe you get a new trinket. Hey there. Hello. Is there something that with the boar? Yeah, there is, but I need a quartz. No, that's the bear. I need a cobalt petrified wood and a gold earring. And this will do what? This decreases the speed at which horse self and stamina cause drain. Okay, so the boar and the bear ones really nice, right? And then I'll sell some stuff. And maybe buy some things if there is anything. There is a limit to how much um, of a certain thing you can carry. Yeah, so I should definitely not keep hold of everything here. Is there a limit to how many gold bars? You can carry up to 30 gold bars. Okay. So I think I should sell everything else and maybe keep the gold bars. Maybe sell one? Should I sell one? So, like, do I want 5,500? That is, it'll give me 6k, right? So every any time I die, if I die with 6k, this time I will lose 5% of that, rather than 25%, which I was losing before, which would equal to $300, right? But would I be happy paying $300 on death rather than just carrying 1,000, like if I sold one? And paid 50 bucks. We'll just keep the 555. Like, do I need to sell any of them? I don't think so. I have no plans to buy anything over that amount of money, right? For right now. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just keep them. What have you got I can buy? Dynamite. Yeah, please. Let's buy everything, please. Almost done for the day. So now, it's two in the morning, and I still cannot find my other shoe. Don't tell me you use the Hello, mister. Hey, don't give it away. <sighs> Jack no, you tied the book to your foot? How could you? Who's talking? The mud was everywhere. I needed to get to the house before. Look at this piece of shit here. Excuse me? Hey there, fellas. Looking sharp. Got something to say? You just called me a piece of shit. Whoa, alright. Just passing on through. Go on then. I don't want to cause trouble in the city. Whoa, we scared him off. My, I don't care. My, my ego does not care. <laughs> Try and wind me up all you want, mate. I'm not biting. There's a secret card here somewhere. Um. This is on the table. Uh, 
Hello, sir. Hello. You see a secret code around here, mate? Yeah, put it away, Alpha, quickly, and um, we need to find the tavern fast, otherwise I'm going to pass out. Where's the closest? Uh, is this one open? I don't forget a face. You knew? Yeah, I am. Can I get a bed? What can I get you? Oh, you don't do boarding. You just do drinks. No, this is the wrong bar for Excuse me. Mate. This is not the right one. I'm going to pass out. Have I got any coffee? Does coffee work? Do I have coffee? I must have coffee. About to pass out. No, I don't think I have it. Can would candy help? Some sugar rush? I just grabbed a gun off my horse. I passed out. Nope, I'm still waiting. Oh, Billy! No, I have, I've passed out. <laughs> my horse bin got run over. Oh, I got run over. Get up. Are we all good? Good sank. I would have been fine if this place had a bed. Is that guy okay? Having fun, mister? Hello. He's just drunk. Come here, Billy. We still need to find a bed, even though we did pass out for a little while. Yeah, nice. I can dual wield now. Cool. What would I want to dual wield, though? No, would I want to dual wield? I'd rather, I'd rather not dual wield, right? And, but I'd like having the sword off. Because now I can always so carry a shotgun with me without carrying, like, the big shotgun. It's, the sword off is probably one of the best shotguns, really, in it. In a pinch, you need to whip it out. So this is the one I want to go to. Stop! You got the answer to the law. Oh! Law don't scare me. Okay. I got him. Whoa! What the hell? You can't cross the law and live. Someone help! You got him, guys. Let me let go. Good job, you got this one. Been a long time coming. No problem. Hey, boy. No rewards. I didn't even get a high honor ding for that. Bit of a hypocrite, right? All the crimes I commit, and then I lasso some random guy who I have no idea what he done. Oh. Might just be a shoplifter. <laughs> what are you doing? Like, that's out of character to me, right? I thought I would do it because it might give me high honor points, but if if you were to choose to do that, right, and you weren't just purposely doing a high honor playthrough, I'd be a bit, eh, really? Why? <laughs> I question that now, since I got nothing for it. Why did I bother? Nice to see you. You're right, mate. Can I get a drink first, Everyone's please? This table. And no then way. a bed. Oh, what do you have? Can I get a whiskey? Your whiskey. Thank you. You're someone's driver, I assume. What? It's okay. I, I was just curious. I mean, you know, I used to be able to tell a man standing with a, a single glance at his guitar. <laughs> These days, with the oil men, the railway men, you simply don't know. A millionaire can look like a farmhand. <laughs> A driver at the bar? <laughs> you never would have seen it in the 70s. Anyway, I I, I probably shouldn't be seen talking to you. <laughs> well, you're the one who started the conversation. Why are you staring so? No reason to be treating people that way. You looking for trouble, partner? The hell's your problem? Who the hell's this guy joining in? If you're so desperate for a fight... <laughs> This was none of your business, mate. Oh, no, I'm the soul. Crime reported. I hate Saint Denis. Can't just have like a bar for it. Really? Let's take a look. I'll put you on the floor. What the hell with you? Stay there. Alright. Your next step is into the ground. What about the other guy? Okay, throw me in jail. Fuck's sake. 
No need to cause a fuss. Just come with me. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna cause a fuss. C'est insensé. You knew this was gonna happen, right? What actually happens when you get arrested? I don't think I ever have been. Oh, hello. Load above. Ah, uh, Mr. Bounty Hunter. It's Lindsay Wofford. Mr. Carpetbagger. <laughs> it's not one man you're messing with now. <laughs> why, why is he sitting on me? Is this his revenge? <laughs> so what happens? I just sleep in and I pay the four dollars. That's that's much better, right, than fucking running off and fighting the. The police and getting a bigger bounty. That's all that happens. Is Wofford still in here? Yeah, he's standing on his bed now. <laughs> I'm more than happy to put you back in jail so you watch yourself. I'm reformed. It's only a bar fight, mate. Chill out. Morning. Morning. No? When do you get executed? Everything all right, sir? Well, I see you didn't get the message last time. Well, I'll be keeping an eye on you, that's for sure. Are you talking to me? I'm a different man, sir. A good man. Good morning, mister. Hey, mister. Good morning. Because I do execute him. I would like to know the dates. I can watch. Welcome. Here for a show? Uh, actually, I'm here for a cigarette card. M maybe after, you know? Maybe show afterwards. I'm not quite sure where they are. A side table. Show's starting soon. It's hey now, you'll need a ticket. Oh, I need a ticket, do I? Okay. Sure. Can I buy a ticket, please? Head straight through those double doors. The double doors. Okay. What double doors? That one, I guess. But, uh, is it, it's not in the table, is it? No. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, I'll go, see, I'll go see the show in case I miss it, and then when I come out, I can have a look around, I guess. There's, there's another one somewhere else as well. This place is very fancy. I sit? I don't know where I can sit. Okay. Do they just wait for me to turn up and then show? Hello! I guess so. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome, everyone. I am your host, Aldridge T. Abington. Hello. Thank you. Yes, Aldridge T. Abington. Few men have had a career more crowded with incident and various intercourse with the world than I. During extensive travel through this and foreign lands, I have procured a show so fantastical there exists nothing like it anywhere. In an effort to bring this entertainment to even the poorest dreamer of dreams, I have determined the ticket price should be very low and the show held without a profit to me it's true oh, what was that i'm thirsty for it is blessing enough to bring these gifted artists to you can i drink i should have got a drink with me i discovered this next act in a tiny village in italy truly the most exotic of places in the world he was just a 10 year old boy i raised him I bathed him. I shaved him from head to toe. He is truly a wonder to behold. Presenting Benjamin Lazarus. Mason. <laughs> Did he know how to leave then? <laughs> and mystical prowess, my dear ladies and gentlemen. Now, it's unfortunate fact that in this mortal coil we are all born to suffer from all manner of maladies in daily life. Who here has not had a friend or loved one near death's door from coal gas fumes, typhoid fever, diphtheria, or the bite? 
of a rabid animal. The greatest wealth is What is that noise? Health. All the gold in the world cannot purchase it, and yet it is the most delicate and tenuous of all life's gifts. And nothing knocks down death's door faster than this. <laughs> A man cannot outrun a bullet. Many fools have tried and failed in this endeavor, including the tonic salesman I caught bedding my wife. I joke. I joke. <laughs> I assure you, he has met his maker and they are playing gin rummy among the molten lava of Hades. I have traveled all around the world, this delighting young and old with all manner of feats of amazement, but none are as dangerous as what I am prepared to attempt tonight. My dead eyes running out because of this we'll hand stupid this drink. DD Packenbush revolver over to my assistant and stand at considerable distance across the stage. She will point the revolver at my head and pull the trigger using lightning quick reflexes taught to me by a tiny man I met in the distant Orient. I will catch the bullet in my teeth. Yes, my teeth. To prove that these are indeed live rounds, if my sharpshooting assistant would be so kind as to shoot this bottle of Lalicola off my head. All well, my cores are running out. Yeah. Off my head. I could do without a bullet in the brain right now. Can you hurry up? I don't want to miss it if I open up my wheel to get a drink. Good job. I can't open my wheel. <laughs> that this always scares me. <laughs> now, observe as I, the great Benjamin Lazarus, will do what no man has ever done and treat death as if it were nothing. I can't and, uh, what? I'm really suffering here. Am I going to die from dehydration? Shoot him so I can leave. Oh my God. I'll get closer. He just called out in his teeth. <laughs> Show us yes. 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 Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well done. All right. Let's do that again. Hmm? All right. hmm. oh, I can't take it. Yeah, get a better close, closer look. You're pulling my leg. This is a bunch of dang balderdash. Ah. <laughs> a skeptic. Hmm? Who said that? Ah. I'm Benjamin Lazarus. I assure you, I am not participating in some hoax or carnival ruse. These bullets are 100% real. In fact, I challenge any member of the audience to come forward with their own firearm, and I will yet again display my uncanny skill to well, I'm already here. a bullet in my Did teeth. All right, let's Fantastic. go. Fantastic. Yeah. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I will prove to you I am the greatest entertainer to ever live and the only man who laughs at death. Now, ready? Take aim. Can I pull my gun out? And fire. He is talking to me, right? Yeah. Sorry, I have to reload. <laughs> Can I aim like at your balls instead? <laughs> I'm so I'm shit accuracy, mate. I missed. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Fly trap. Amazing. Sorry, guys. Oh, my face. What is wrong with my face? <laughs> He's just fine. <laughs> What's wrong with fine. my face? Please be calm. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just entertainment <laughs> anyway. Oh, wonderful. Yes, it, it, it just felt like a, it's a bit like a lynching, only less American. Marvelous stuff. Marvelous. Yeah. Bring it. Now, I'm still going. I discovered this next remarkable woman in a lost jungle <laughs> deep in the wilds of Colombia where they do not wear 
clothes. She breathes fire. Yes, she does. And for those with the universal and not unworthy curiosity, yes, I can attest, she does emit fire from almost We're every orifice right. in her body. <laughs> what? <laughs> Presenting Antoinette San Servino. Woo! I'm like dead on my feet. I'm like absolutely shattered. Very impressive. She just lit a stick. Love how no one cares I'm just standing at the front gawking at these performances. I have to remember that in future, that I don't have to just sit at the back. That might be the same for like watching films and stuff. Let's just like walk up to the screen. <laughs> I have very bad eye vision. I'm short sighted. I have to be as close as I can. Also, this person is not naked. I thought they said they were naked. She sure is hot! So there is apparently loads of different types of shows here. I will need to return like four more separate times to unlock a cigarette card. So I will be returning here over the course of this playthrough for more shows. I'll marry you. Not sure if you could just stack them all up, like one or the other, but I won't do that anyway. Because I think I, there needs to be a certain mission as well that needs to unlock to get this card. What is that? Alcohol? Make sure you don't inhale the flames. It needs to be like a special type, doesn't it? I mean, many people have killed themselves trying to do that, right? So like just put some vodka in their mouth, spit it out and light it, not thinking that the flame will go into your mouth because that's where the vodka is as well, right? Is it, it's either some sort of special alcohol or they do something to coax their like no it must be special alcohol because it goes into your lungs right you can't coax your lungs can you what I'm saying fire lubricant what's that nah that doesn't make sense drum roll for what yeah ah! you try to blow a name in my face No crowd participation in this one, though. Is there any more? This is well worth two dollars. Oh, wonderful! Oh, incredible! It's still hot in here, huh? <laughs> yeah, incredible! Bravo! Though I must warn you, court her at your peril. She'll not nurse babies. She'd turn them into bacon. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. He liked that joke, yes. I discovered this next woman in the kingdom of Poland, where she sang by the roadside, subsisting on coppers tossed at her feet. Miss Robin Koninsky. Yay. Oh God, I hope I don't pass out. I should've gone to sleep. How long's the show? <laughs> Really need a drink. Why is the bar not open? Hello. Thanks for joining us today. Hello. This here was a new song about a so-called modern improvement you may have become aware of called the telephone. Maybe this maybe sitting down will help my, my sleepiness. From Blackwater to Valentine to San Denis. And they propose to distribute them oh. 
to all what manner of places, so that no matter where you are, somebody is looking for you. A What's going on? Prayed that one day we may all eventually be gathered together. Is that in them playing? Of everlasting rest and Am I dying? And bliss, except for the inventor of the telephone. Because someone is always going on? calling, saying, "Hello, hello, hello." Got like a hello. remix going. <laughs> got a little baby, but he's out of sight. Talk to him I'm gonna stand back up, boys. Stop! I wish it'd stop. I can't see my honey, but he's mine, all right. This gal just can't leave a man alone. That's a bit antagonistic, wasn't it? Hello. I cheered. <laughs> That's why I didn't like the act. Get off the stage. Basically, right? <laughs> Might be of my sister, sexy. Who said that? <laughs> Woo! Woo this is great. Is that it? Three acts, you think? Oh, oh, what a fine tune! She is a siren, singing from the rocks as men bash into them to their doom. Thank you for joining me for tonight's entertainment. I hope it has delayed for at least a moment the crushing and remorseless misery of this mortal coil. We Good want night. more! No, we don't. Dream well and come back soon. Goodbye. I must go before I pass out and die of dehydration. Okay. You feeling better? Thinking about our next show. No, I'm thinking about my bed, mate. I need to get there quickly before I pass out again. Bonjour, monsieur. <laughs> Bonjour. Right, can I go to the bar now? It was greyed out. It's still greyed out. This is like the wrong one. Where's the other one? I'm just gonna have to sleep in like an alleyway. No rest. Could sit on the bench. Could sleep on the bench. Can take an eight hour nap. Must be nice, just taking your leisure. Huh. Come on. Can I play, guys? Can I play dominoes? What the hell is play all fives? Pull up a chair. Hello. How do you play dominoes? I did play as a kid. Like with my dad. Oh, I can't remember. You, Whose go is it? Arthur has the highest double or tile and goes first. Doubles take priority. So, I want to play a double then because it gives me 12. Does it? No! No! God damn it! <coughs> this ain't looking great for you. No? 
We're in some trouble, my friend. A six and a four? Doesn't matter which side is it. So the edge score is now five, yeah, makes sense. So if I played that right, I'd be five, six, seven, eight. Thirteen? That's the best thing to do, isn't it? You've I think so. I oh, see, but because it's a different type of dominoes, you only score on the fives. Called all fives. Right, sorry. So... Play there, does that, does that count as an edge? With the other fives? Perfect, just perfect. Oh, I played five on the wrong side, need the fives need to be on the edges. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm understanding, I'm understanding. But I can't go anywhere, I don't think, really, to, to get any points, can I? Where would I put the... Th oh, I'll do about the bottom. Should we go that way? But he's laid a four in the end, and he scored some points. Ah. Does it have to add up to a multiple five? Is that how it works? So I'm a bit confused. A bit confused, I don't know how to play. <laughs> Wish you would tell me how many points you'd get if you would play... Like, if I was to play that six, it'd be... What in the end sense? A ten. So would that be... Score zero, no. Yes! That's the spirit. I don't know what, to, what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I scored points there. Why? Domino, folks. Oh, you did oh, well. Oh, hello there. He just played all their tiles and wins the round. You'll get precious little from me. I don't. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Twenty bonus points awarded to the winner. Yeah, it's gonna be a big comeback here. I don't, I don't see. Play immediately scores the total of the open ends if it is a multiple of five. A multiple of five. Ah, uh, okay, 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 okay. I got you. I got you. Okay, I will go again though for this because now I know how to play. So I'm going to lose. You hoping I'll die of boredom? Ten points. All right. Now we talk. Four fifty. That's all you win. Lady Not much. Come. She loves another. Are we going again, guys? Can we like get a new like hand? <laughs> no one's no one's scoring any points. It can't last. Come on. Yeah, somebody, someone going to score anything? He did. Domino, right here. Not bad. You win because you placed all your tiles, so you get points for placing all your tiles as well. You ain't gonna get too much from me. And Domino's loses uses up a lot of mental capacity, doesn't it? I never realised. Oh, I'm just really stupid. <laughs> You're in a tough spot, partner. Ah, crap. I'm gonna keep drawing? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's no good. What the fuck? So I guess I need, what, is it a five? I need a five. <laughs> what happens if there's no more to draw? Okay. <laughs> Does it matter which way? Does that build it going up the other way? Like that would be just building it this side. The edge score would be a six, right? If I build it this way, well, I guess it would. Does it count the the, the spinner? Does that count as an edge? So would it be? Yeah, that counts as ten, right? So that'd be sixteen that side. And this side it would be eleven. You go here. I mean, maybe I should go on the other side because then that way, if they were to score, then they would have scored low. Glad I'm not working with that. I'll pass. For fuck's sake, I've got like all the dominoes. Like, surely I can play, score some points, right? All these bloody things. Perfect, just perfect. I'm gonna score doing this. Can't score anything. If it's taking this long, it's a bad decision. Shut up. Gonna pass. Domino, folks. Lady, look. Oh, right to hello fits. there. Bastard. Bastard. Just how many points do you get? Be happy. My tiles worth 45 points. Oh, this suits me very well. Just well. What a shame. Ugh. 
so annoying. Don't want to. I can't. I need to keep playing until I win. I can't leave. You want to play? I can't leave the table. What's wrong with me? If you are not interested in dominoes, you can skip. I do leave chapters in my videos for people to skip because skipping is inevitable for some people. Some things might just be boring. I try to do everything in this game that is experienced, and some things may be a bit boring than others. Obviously, this obviously will be edited down rather than the full amount of time I am playing it for. But the next thing that would happen, whether it's a random encounter or a mission or whatever, it should be chapters, like everything else is. But I just suck. I'm getting addicted. <laughs> now I know how to play. I just want to win one game. That's all. I'm not sure on what the strategies are for dominoes. I just I know I can. I know how to score now. Right. That's that's all it is. I'm just trying to score. No. No. God damn it. That's not looking up, amigo. Got any fives? Damn, that's not pretty. Same thing happened to me last game, motherfucker. How'd you like it? Go on, pick all those tiles up. Having fun? Oh. Domino, right here. Fuck off. Not bad. Cleave. There's one tile left. Well, I don't think this will help you too much. Yeah, that gets me points. There. And points for me. Another ten points. Come on, catching it up with, uh, what's Come your name? On. I don't even know what his name is. This gives me points. Don't you dare, don't 15. you dare. Come on. Come on, you bastards. This gives me points. Twenty points. Come on. Domino, folks. Oh, get what? Oh, hello there. Oh, you motherfucker, how many points do you get? I only need ten more points. Well, you ain't gonna be too excited, I'm afraid. Well, fuck you, Cleve. Come on. Come on, ten points is all I need. It's all I need. And then I get to win like three dollars or something. <laughs> yeah, what? Fuck you guys. Motherfuckers. Come to me. 450. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Unlucky there. I win. Guess I better be heading off. You guess the game finishes, right, when it happens? Nice. Fuck you guys. God, wait until I get to bloody poker and I'll be there forever. <laughs> Should we do, um... Who is this? Yeah, have you a squirrel? I'm wanted dead or alive down in Blackwater, right? I think we should go and rescue Sean, because that's what this is. I think we should head over that way. Hello. Heard screams. Oh, there's gonna be alligators in here. Throw it up. Who is that? Where are they? Can I ride through without yeah. getting bitten? Hello? Stranger? Where are they? Hello? Man, you all right? Hello? Man? You okay, man? Talk to me. Excuse me? Hello? I'm not gonna hurt you. Uh -oh. Oh! Oh, no, really? Whoa. Fuck me. <laughs> Panic's a little bit there, but it's fine. Who are these guys called? I've forgotten what they're called. I think they're special people, right? The, the people that kill people with knives and stuff. Well, I'll kill you with uh, your own medicine, shall I? Creep. <laughs> the night folk, in it. That's what they're called, I think. It's what um, Lindsay Wofford said he was going to feed me to, right? I think they're cannibals. You think 
all this Lemoyne air is free for you? Shut up. Don't want any trouble. Just passing through. You look like you might need a few smacks to set you straight. You're done! <laughs> I guess I was told. <laughs> Moron. You ain't got no friends here, no? You're just doing the troll toll by yourself? Okay, we're approaching the province of where Blackwater is located. Blackwater in the surrounding area is in lockdown because the law is after me. Wanted dead or alive in the area of Great Plains, West Elizabeth. So I will need to try and dodge these guys whilst I go to heavier. There's a couple right behind me. Look like they're going the wrong way. Should be simple enough, although I say that when I tried to come in here before, my low on a playthrough, I struggled to get there. <laughs> Causing all loads of problems. Being chased by everyone. But to be honest, that's because I was fucking up. Right. I remember I was looking for like a treasure. I thought one of the landmarks was in this area. So I didn't go straight for the mission. I was just wandering around. That's why. Have you? Ah. Hi, guys. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. Is this Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? I... <clears throat> Where is that little Irish bastard? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Behind us. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen. Hello. Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or we cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Cut him loose is annoying. Of course not. <laughs> Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. Let's go. Rescue Sean. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. At who? Sure, well... We'll rescue Sean, and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Just in general? Or at Dutch? Time to go, boy. And the cowboys. The cow folk. All of us, guys. Are they angry at us? Find the boats. Yeah, I will do. Can I remove this marker that I set on? It's going to annoy me. Thank you. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes. South of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Who? Heidi McCourt? Who the hell is that? There, look. I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Keep your guns away. I don't know how to... No I never shot, know how to steer a okay? fucking horse in this. I can't even move now. I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, Billy. we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. 
Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. Look, they've stopped. All right, let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen? Enhance. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys, but I hear they're a big crew and wild. Built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. Hello. Charles. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Let's murder them. We should do this quietly if we can. Leave it to me. Sure. Got some us. Yep. Gentlemen, I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Stay here. Knifey knife. Stay here. I do have like a fantasy knife as well, don't I? I thought I went to my like um Civil War knife. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. From the, the fort? I picked up? Unique weapon, right? Where the hell is that? Wait here. He's still reeling them in. Gentlemen. Maybe you have to choose a like, your, your weapons wardrobe here, or brother. something. My wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You take She's the one on the left. Where is Let's she? go now. Keep down. I, I, I'm... Can I use the big tomahawk no, instead? I, the hatchet? If I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. Are you ready, Javier? Uh, <laughs> so I was quite lucky it killed him, really, didn't it? <laughs> Can I get this back? Okay. Thank you. Let's get after him. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you. Bye bye, Lancaster. Sure. From here. I'm not sure why the default for the mission thinks I want to take a varmint rifle Come with on. me. Do a bit of hunting while I'm out here. Up the canyon to deal with. Okay. Well, we just go loud, right? We're gonna have to shoot our way up there. It's I remember so trying to go quiet before, Let's and have you just spooked them? Could I have gone quiet? Ow. That's how you want to do it, history. Fuck you, buddy. Oh, I'm still bleeding out. Hello? Who's shooting? Are we good? I think he's bleeding out, mate. Move on, dude. Push up on him! On who? How many on horses? None. You good? Another one on the cliff. You see him? No. Oh yeah. I see Charles up there. Quick. You going, on, Charles? Let's get up there. No. Lead the way, come on. No, I'll lead it then. Hey, watch out for these two! Oh fuck, what? Did you eat that bullet? Did I shoot you in the back? Sorry. 
Here's Charles. All good? Wouldn't go that far. The camp's up this way. Come on. You're going to thank me for shooting your foe? No? I'll take the left side, Charles. You go right, okay? I guess. Take him down! Ah! Ow! Goddamn army of these bastards! He's, he's bleeding out. He's bleeding out. Leave him alone. We should turn him in ourselves. Still time. Anyone up? Let's push forward. Look out. We got one shooting from the tower. How many more? Ow. Oh, is, the, is that dynamo next to me? Move up. Come on. Not a good place to hide, right? That is dynamo, right? <laughs> Who are you shooting? We got more coming down the hill. Oh, fuck. Gosh, trying to run away. away. We all good? Okay. Let's get Sean. Hey, someone cut this rope. Me head's killing me. Is it? Arthur. <laughs> Hello. You know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? No. A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it. I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. It's true. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper I can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm going to see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine y'all missed me a lot, but fear not, the joy's back in your lives now. Cool.